anything out of those chances early or, or encouraged by the fact that you were getting those kind of chances? Probably, probably both. You know, um, you know, I thought we, we created a lot of chances, a lot more. Uh, I think, uh, you know, we almost had two to one in terms of chances, but uh, didn't convert early. You know, I mean, it was almost like the uh, uh, our previous game, St. Louis had some chances early, and, and uh, they didn't score, and then they got a power play goal. But um, I thought, obviously, first period we had that. You know, it was, some of that was self-inflicted. Uh, we didn't kill off the penalty, um, and then we had a uh, bad line change, and then we got beat back to the net. You know, next shift, and that, that was uh, down three-one, and we're down. Uh, you know, came back twice. So I like the character that we showed against a very good team. I mean, you know, they're defending. Western Conference champions are a good hockey team. Um, you know, when, when we came back twice, I thought our second period we were outstanding. I, we had loads of ch uh, chances and, and uh, really the, a huge, like, almost game-changing type of save by Luongo. Um, I think it was Colin Wilson. So uh, I thought for the most part we managed uh, uh, them pretty well tonight. Uh, there's some areas obviously and we had to tighten up, but. Uh, you know, I, I thought uh, we easily could have had two points and been on the other side of a, uh, you know, uh, of a shootout, uh, maybe even a regulation win. So um, it was it was a good you know, it was a good test. I'm going to take the point. I was facing that. I thought we played pretty well in, in a lot of areas. It seemed like after the game settled down in the second period, it became quite a goaltending battle between between the two. Yeah, and both are uh, great goaltenders. You know, they're. Uh, Roberto with Vancouver and obviously packs with us. Um, you know, uh, you're seeing teams you know going in that hard. Uh, both teams are, are pretty good offensively. Uh, can create off uh, different elements of the game in the offensive zone, off the rush. Uh, use some of the cycle techniques back in that. Uh, um, you know, some interchanges, all those things that can create some offense. And, uh, you know, they they both battled for pucks and made some great saves. So. Yeah, they were they were testing each other and showing off to each other. Think, you know, I make one, you make one, and, and uh, go from there. They're better at creating and converting one timers than maybe a lot of other teams are. Though they're they're pretty talented. I mean, they're the, to me, uh, no, it's not necessarily the, the shooting skills. It's it's their, their passing skills that are are really good. And it starts obviously with the Sedins, and you know, uh, they've got some, some pretty pretty good skill up front. You got. You say you feel pretty good going to the shootout with Pekka. Uh, were there a few moments where you thought you may have had it? Um, kind of I don't know. I, I was just watching the crowd. I never watched, so really, I, I just I heard a couple posts and stuff. And I never watch a shootout. I watch a crowd. They're 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 more fun. <laughs> uh, power play. Sorry, on, the, on Vancouver's penalty kill, do anything special to frustrate your power play? Or? No, we were, we were really frustrated. We were. It was just we didn't. Uh, we had some chances where you have some seams and you got to convert on them and, 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 and jump into those seams. And, uh, we did at times, but then we, we tried an extra pass here and there. And um, then we had some good looks. So we, we should have scored one. Willie really should have scored one on the, on the uh, say the Roberto made. So yeah, sometimes you, you know you get you're not going to get a ton of chances, but the chances you get, you got to convert on it. Luongo made one of those those saves. That, I mean, we should, we should have scored one there, but it, 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 that's why your your best penalty killer is always your goaltender. You uh, when you first looked up at the board on Kostitz and the Kostitz goal, were you worried that one was coming no, back? No, not at all. Because he was facing our way. I mean, I mean if they had called that back. I would have, I probably would have had a, a heart attack right there because uh, he was facing our our uh, our net. And if you're going to kick a puck in. You know, when it's a slap pass, you know, I mean, you can direct it in. But, you know, you got to be someone unbelievably talented and good to kick a puck in when you're coming towards our net, uh, high in the slot. And for that not to be a uh, like, goal, oh, I would have, I probably would have had the big one. Is it just that uh, Gabriel Bork again? What sort of went into that? Well, I just I, I really felt uh, tonight uh, the the the, tr the draw. You know, starting with the puck was really important, especially in our own end. And uh, you know, Spinny's been, uh, you know, he's in the top 20 in the league in, in face-offs, and um, he was real strong tonight. I don't know what he ended up. I know he was five and home after two periods, but 
Uh, that was the, the main focus was penalty killing and, and, and draw. And, you know, he's he's got good experience against a very talented team. The Canucks have thrived off first period success all year. Is there anything different that they do in the first period to kind of capitalize on? No, yeah, absolutely not. It just the pucks are going in. Yeah, I can't say anything technically or you know we weren't ready. We were ready. I mean, we, were, we came out pretty good. I just I don't have an answer for you. It's one of those uh, those things that you just go. I don't have an answer for you. So yeah, they. You know, I mean, we've most of this year. You know, Again, all, all three games, we've been chasing them because they've had the lead. And that's a, that's a hard way to play when you're chasing the game all the time. But, you know, we came back big in, in Vancouver, and, and we came back big tonight. I mean, we were down twice and by a couple of goals, and, and uh, it was a good comeback point for us, and we could have the, we could have the win. Do you think that was one of the stronger efforts you've made where you didn't get two points this year? Um, yeah, I'd probably say that. It was one of the, the better efforts that, in terms of our, uh, our game against a, a very good opponent um, and not getting two points out. Yeah, sometimes that happens. You know? um, but, uh, you know, when I went to a shootout, I, I thought you know, both teams played well enough that, you know, it's, it's probably fitting that you're, you're going to go to a shootout and anything can happen. So, uh, I'm not, I'm, at this point, we don't have two, but at the same time, we're down 3 1 and against a very good team that to get a point out of the game, uh, you got to be able a little bit satisfied, but you know, but, yeah, we're coaches and players. We want to win every game, so um, I'm, not, I'm not, you know, jumping for joy or anything. But uh, it's a good point. As I say, you never know what point will make the difference from, you know, being in the playoffs, being ahead of someone in the standings, what have you. You know, yeah, so we'll take the point and we'll start all over and head to Ottawa. Right. Thank you. Thanks.